हेलो आई वेलकम यू टू द सेकेंड एपिसोड ऑफ टॉक फिजिक्स टूडेज टॉपिक इज स्केलर्स एंड वेक्टर्स नाउ यू आर अवेयर ऑफ वॉट फिजिकल क्वांटिटीज आर बेसिकली वी आर क्वांटिटीज विच कैन बी मेजर्ड सच एज डिस्टेंस डिस्प्लेसमेंट स्पीड velocity current voltage etc etc now can the physical quantities be classified yes of course and scalars and vectors are the ways in which physical quantities can be classified let us try to understand them better with the example of distance if i say that the distance between point a and point b is 10 km i am giving complete information by simply specifying the magnitude i do not need to specify the direction because distance between point a and point b is the same as the distance between point b and point a isn't it the physical quantities which can be described by their magnitude alone are scalars so distance is a scalar now let us try to understand what vectors are think of the physical quantity displacement when you want to describe displacement it is not sufficient simply to give magnitude you need to inform about the direction as well you can say that someone is moving from a towards right by 10 km or someone is moving from point a towards left by 10 km you will understand that both the situations are not similar because the final position of the two people who have who have moved towards the right and towards the left from point a are going to be different that means while describing displacement you need to in form about both the magnitude as well as direction all the physical quantities which need both magnitude and direction are called as vectors displacement is is an example of vectors with the similar logic speed is a scalar but velocity which is rate of change of displacement is a vector similarly acceleration which is rate of change of velocity is also a vector now if i ask you what about the physical quantity mass is it a scalar or a vector correct it is a scalar and what about weight you know that weight is a product of mass and acceleration due to gravity weight is analogous to a force force is a vector weight is also a vector because the direction is also important what about the physical quantity temperature correct it's a scalar and what about the physical quantity momentum which is a product of mass and velocity correct it is a vector so in this manner now you can recall all the physical quantities you know and try to classify them into scalars and vectors all right then till our next episode take care and bye